is Since We've Ended as Lovers, a beautiful song written by Stevie Wonder and, in my opinion, immortalized by Jeff Beck. And it's a pretty straight ahead arrangement that I did, very simple. Uh, it's all about that lyrical melody and these lovely chords underneath. So first the introduction, I'm doing this, um, this uh, D add 9, or yeah, D add 9, for adding the minor. And then B flat. And this is sort of a big stretch. If you, want, if you don't want to do that, you could also do, do like that, or else this. And then G minor. That's also kind of tricky, pretty big stretch. To make it a little easier, you could just use your pinky here and not bother with playing on the G string. D sus to D major. And then the first verse. And you want everything to ring as long as possible. And the hammer-on's really important. And same melody down an octave. Now this might be the toughest stretch. Just sort of awkward here, that stretch. It's pretty awkward. If you want to get around it and make it a little easier, you can just do this without needing to involve the D string. But I'm doing it this way. And this here is a little tricky because you have a bass note very close. You just want to articulate it very well. And I'm doing a hammer on just to bring it out a bit more. Again, that. Pretty straightforward. This is an E set over an E7, then G minor. This is another big stretch. You don't need to use the G string. You can just, or you don't need to fret on the third fret of the G, of the G string as I am. You can make it a little easier like this. And the C9, D sus, D major. Then I took a solo where the verse changes, which is just D minor to B flat to G minor. D sus to D, and then the chorus. E7, G minor, C7, D sus, D major. And then the last time through, I just repeat the very first verse. D sus and D to end it. That's it, very simple. But uh, just absolutely beautiful if you just focus on the chords and letting those melody notes ring as long as possible. Let me know any questions you might have, and uh, thanks for watching.